I am Susan's learning coach and I have cancer. I have to go to the hospital regularly for chemo treatments, which makes me very sick and weak. My daughter misses a lot of school because she comes with me to the hospital. My husband travels and my daughter doesn't want to be home alone while I'm having chemo. She's scared and hurt because she's afraid I will die and leave her. I know this is hard on Susan, but I don't know what to do. I'm fighting for my life and Susan is scared. This is more important than school for us right now. I do want Susan to do well in school. She is in ninth grade and has to graduate. I want that. I want to be a good parent and make sure she is going to school. This just makes me feel so guilty. I just don't know what to do. Hi, I'm a ninth grader at UTVA. My mom and dad are getting a divorce and I don't understand why they are not getting along. All I know is that they are always fighting. I have a brother who is in fourth grade and this is really, really hard on him. Dad signed us up for online school because he thought it would help my anxiety. And it has. I actually like going to school this way. But my mom was completely against it. She's fighting for us to attend a regular school and trying to tear us away from my dad. She wants the court to think our dad is wrong by signing us up for online school. She says he is unfit to take care of us and we should never be allowed to go to his house. My brother and I are caught in the middle of spending half of our week with my mom, who doesn't want anything to do with UTVA, and half of the week with my dad, who tells us to log into school and go to class. The only problem is he goes to work during the day, so I end up having to help my brother, which makes it really hard for me to get my assignments done. My brother is trying, but sometimes I can't make him go to class, so he ends up sitting around playing video games. I just wish I could have a normal life and be able to focus on getting good grades. I know if I could if I just didn't have all of this going on. I am an 8th grader at UTVA. When my family moved to Utah, my parents said we had an apartment to move into. We finally got here, the apartment was being lived in by someone else. We didn't know anyone and we didn't have anywhere to stay. This was really scary for me. We ended up staying with people we didn't know from our church. I didn't have any privacy or place to put all of my things. We had to store everything in a storage unit. I didn't have any of my favorite clothes or books or games. I didn't even have a bed to sleep in, and we were never in one house for very long. I guess that's what they call couch surfing. I didn't like it. So my mom had signed us up to go to school at UTVA online school, and I was excited. This meant I didn't have to worry about being bullied or being left out. I was the one who asked my mom if I could go to UTVA. I liked the idea of working at my own pace and not having to worry about the school environment. I was very organized and I do not like to be behind in school. Not having our own place to live in made it impossible for me to do well in school. Sometimes we didn't even have internet where we were staying. I tried using the library, but my life was crazy, and I started feeling bad about myself. This was the first time I was flunking school, but we finally found a place to rent and now everything is going great. In fact, now I'm a straight A student. I'm so glad that part of my life is over.